Don't drive angry. That was Bill Murray from the movie Groundhog Day. And that advice that he gives that groundhog is the best advice that we can give you. Don't drive angry. My name is Matthew Maddox. I'm a lawyer here in New Canaan, Connecticut. And today we're going to speak to you about road rage and speak to you about some of the consequences. And we're going to talk about five don'ts that you need to keep in mind when you're out on the road and trying to keep it cool. Number one, don't tailgate. Um, we've got a couple of statutes in Connecticut about, about tailgating, following too closely. In fact, another statute, uh, following too closely with intent to intimidate or harass. Yes, we have that law in Connecticut. Don't tailgate. It's dangerous and it provokes people. Number two, don't lane block. Move over to the right whenever you can. If there's another car that wants to go faster than you, let it go faster. You're not in a race. There's not a prize at the end. Let vehicles pass you on the highway or other roads where there are multiple lanes. Third, um, don't run red lights. In fact, when the light turns yellow, slow down and stop. The only time that you can go through an intersection and the light is yellow is when the light has in fact turned yellow when you're in the intersection already. The problem is when you run red lights, when you run and accelerate through intersections, people feel that they're at risk and um, it causes people some anxiety and worry. So don't run red lights. Uh, the fourth, don't. Don't use your horn. Use it as little as you possibly can. Uh, when you lay on that horn, it provokes people, you know that, you know, when people honk at you, nobody likes to be honked at. Try not to use your horn. That's one of the causes, one of the most common causes of people getting angry and starting to exchange gestures and you don't want to go there. Fifth, number five for don'ts, please don't get out of your car. Don't ever, ever, ever get out of your car. Once you get out of your car, all bets are off. You never know what's going to happen. Uh, that's when really the risks start to skyrocket as far as what happens on the roadway. Uh, Ultimately, this is all about being patient. Please be patient. And when you're patient, be even more patient. That's the best way to avoid road rage incidents. Be courteous uh, and exercise that patience and follow Bill Murray's advice. Don't drive angry.